So I got the PTO switch in the mail today. And it comes with a block for the uh, wires to go in. And as you can see, someone had pulled all the wires out of the block on mine. So that's very helpful. Now, this is actually a kit here. So they give you these instructions here to tell you how to put it in. And uh, they're in a couple languages in case you need German, Italian, Spanish, or French. But uh, if I can open this up, they give you a diagram. They tell you here, if you have a John Deere LX, here's what all the wires are that go on what spots in the key switch. And the funny thing is that in my manual that I downloaded, they do the same thing and two of the wires are flip-flopped. Like these two here are 180 off in the diagram in the book, but I don't think it matters because either way they're uh, on the same switch side, so I think it's okay. So yeah, we'll put it together and uh, we'll see what happens. All right, we got all the wires uh, plugged into the switch here, just as they are in the diagram. And now I'm just gonna pop the switch into the dash and it just has these two tabs that lock it in. And we'll insert that plug and we'll see what happens. Okay, the plug's in there. So I guess you'd call this the moment of truth. If I hit the key, is it gonna crank over or not? Yeah, baby, it cranked over. So let me uh, give it some gas here, or choke, and we'll see what it starts again. Wow. And give it a squirt of ether. So I'm seeing why it's not starting. I got the throttle up in choke, but you can see the choke plate down here is not closing all the way. So something just has to get adjusted in the linkage here to uh, push it some more. And it looks like there's a screw in here that I can tighten back here in the linkage to make it actually push the choke. So I'm gonna hold the choke forward with my finger here and crank it and see if I can get it to start without using ether. Let's see. I don't know how to hold the phone, I'll try this. Put it down. Yep. Okay, it started. So, the next question is, can I unhook my rig on the ignition module here? Shoot. And hook up the factory ignition, and will it have spark? I hope so. Let's see, let me pull this off of here. Let me put this back on there. Now I'll put it down in idle. We'll see if it starts up. Give it some choke. I guess it's fixed, huh guys? So the next question is, does the PTO work or not? So let's hit the thing and see what happens. I stalled it. Idiot. Give it some choke again.
well that's awesome so i scored this tractor because the wiring was totally screwed up according to the guy i bought it from and it turns out in all reality it needed a pto switch and a fuse and uh that's it so i can put the blower housing back on now and uh, i think that before i turn it over to my grandmother's house i think we're going to take the blades off and sharpen them and we'll grease up the deck and uh, we'll put a new fuel filter in it too and maybe we'll change the oil so yeah that's pretty exciting huh so simple too huh yeah, I don't know how old the gas is in this thing, but it's probably a year old. So before I bring it over there, I'll mow my lawn with it this weekend. And we'll make sure everything's good. But uh, yeah, pretty awesome, huh?